Well, as meteorologist Chris Yates has been talking about, the heat is on here in central Illinois, but fall and apple picking actually aren't too fall, far away. And meteorologist Adam Sherwinski gives us a peek at how the apple crop is faring so far leading up to prime picking season. Fall is closing in, and some of the apple orchards across the region are planning on their apples being ready for the busy season. So far, the apple crop has looked really nice. We've got timely rain, so they're getting good size and hopefully they'll still be real sweet. We did have some frost early this spring that thinned out some of the apples, so there's a few low, low line areas in the orchard that uh, have a lower crop, crop uh, than what I'd like to see, but other than that, everything looks really good. We did have some close calls with frost, but made it through that, thankfully, and so the crop, the fruit set was good, and then the rest of the weather throughout the summer has been has been good too. This year's apples are looking a lot better than what Chris Orchard in Elmwood saw in 2012. In the spring, it was 80 degrees in March, and so the blossoms all opened, and then it got it froze, and so half the blossoms uh, were killed, and so we lost a lot of a crop from that. And then in the summer, it was dry, very hot, so it just you know a lot of sunburn and just quality issues with the apples. While the finish line for apple picking season is almost here, orchards are still keeping an eye on the skies. To ruin it would be a hailstorm; would be devastating. You could get uh, just huge marks and everything, and lots of openings. Uh, for rot and different stuff like that, insects. So that, that could be real devastating. Uh, wind would be the same thing. Knock the, if you had a huge windstorm, knock all the apples off. In central Illinois, meteorologist Adam Trewinski, WMBD News.